Hi, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you this dish called uh, Thai fried rice. Uh, it's looking like this. Okay, I'm going to give you a close up look. Hi, this is Thai fried rice. Look, close up look. Uh, Thai fried rice, close up look. Uh, look, it's like um, it's a regular kind of fried rice. We just don't like uh, we put a little bit like we call Thai sauce, a uh, little bit sweet and uh, uh, like I don't to be honest, I don't know what's inside the Thai sauce, and it just flavor is it's good and also uh, it has a little bit like small vegetable chunks like this, a uh, little bit of from the uh broccoli and then this the green pepper then the uh chopped suey the bean sprout i don't know why it's called chopped suey though it's a bean sprout and then the shrimp i choose shrimp version i like eating shrimps and um, like you can choose also uh, chicken or beef or vegetable only so uh, it's looking like this it's a good portion and uh, simple dish a little bit uh, egg scramble egg scramble egg a little bit so majority is rice so uh this is like this and uh, thai fried rice it's a simple plate and it's supposed to be uh, tasty okay okay let's begin so this is thai fried rice and uh, i choose today i'm choosing the version shrimp and you can choose beef or shrimp, uh, chicken or vegetable only so uh, i'm gonna start this one Hmm. Not the fried rice and uh, tasty. A little bit sweet to the flavor. I like all kinds of fried rice. It's a uh, really nice stuff. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna speed up eating and then let you know what's like uh, when I fin after I finish it. Okay, <clears throat> I finished the, the plate. It's very clean like this. So um, it's called Thai fried rice. As, as I said, all fried rice are really nice to me. I really like all kinds of fried rice. Even the steamed rice, as I showed before, I can eat a bowl of steamed rice by itself. So uh, anything with flavor on the rice, like um, fried rice, it's a bonus for me already, so I am super happy already. But if you let me ask me to eat a, a plate of uh, fried rice by itself and uh, give me in in front of me a, a, a whole diff whole menu of uh, different dishes, I probably would choose not to eat the uh, fried rice by itself. I probably have either like a, a dish with the steamed rice a tasty dish with a heavy flavor with the both rice or a, a, a good dish with a, a plate of fried rice so that's what i call double happiness you know just make it a merrier make it a double so that's what i will say 
but for the plate itself, like the fried rice, it's very safe, very uh, standard. It's it's kind of a you always have a little bit egg, scrambled egg, and then a little bit vegetables or a little protein, either chicken before shrimp, and a little bit vegetable here there. So the flavor is it's always there. It's I don't think any any cook can uh, can mess up like a uh, fried rice, a plate of fried rice, like uh, can botch. Uh, 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 fried rice, unless it's something burned, maybe the egg or some stuff burned. Otherwise, I think uh, a lot of fried rice is pretty decent, pretty good. Like this Thai fried rice for me, it's really good. But I would prefer the Yangzhou fried rice. It's a little, little bit like uh, lighter, but uh, on the color side, it's uh, maybe even a little bit better for me. <laughs> I don't know, but as I said. This one pretty safe, not spicy. It just will be a, a soy sauce taste and a, a sweet taste, and pretty safe. So I don't know why it's called Thai fried rice, but it's maybe close to Pad Thai. Uh, but it's really good. So as I said, it's really good to choose uh, to choose this one. And if you could, probably one fried rice with one. Uh, a dish like maybe meat or vegetable whatever so just make it like double your happiness okay thank you for watching